It's been more than a week since a teenager from Hawaii Island went missing on Oahu. And although the official search is off, his family and even strangers are searching on. 18-year-old Daylin Mokepua was trying to reach the forbidden hike known as Stairway to Heaven. After several days, the Honolulu Fire Department called off its search, but family members and volunteers are still holding out hope. Sarah Yoro has more on today's search efforts. Sarah? Kathy, it's a fight against the clock to find him. Today, volunteer search groups followed up on leads and took to the skies to find any new clues. Volunteers gathered in Kaneohe on Saturday hoping to find 18 year old Dalen Mokepua. Private helicopters, hikers, and spotters searched the mountaintops for any signs of him. We just wanted to go up there and get some really good. Photos of the different areas and stuff just to document everything to, um, you know, be able to tell is this, is this actually a person or is this just a piece of white rock? Is this a skin mark or is it just exposed rock? So um, we didn't find anything, but it was good just to go and check out those leads and, you know, confirm that that wasn't anything. Family members and volunteers believe Dalen entered through this gate and hiked through the rough terrain to reach the haiku stairs rather than entering through the Kaniohe side. Throughout the day, people brought food and water for the family and volunteers stationed in Moanalua Valley. Even complete strangers found themselves getting involved. When you're a father, you feel another father's heart, I think. Um, we didn't know the family, but we just felt the need to be out here. They're from the Big Island, and we just felt that Oahu people would be nice just to support the family. It's been really hard on our family. Loki, you know you got all the love and the support from your family. From here in Oahu, all over the world, and back home. So come home, Moki. We are waiting for you. I'm told that another family member will be flying to Oahu in the next day or two. The family tells me they are thankful for the outpouring of love and support from the community. Sarah Yoro, KHON 2 News.